Hey, how are you guys? Ready to rock and roll for today's class? <laughs> oh my God, I do have only one baby girl and the rest of them is a boy. There are boys actually. Hey, how are you? Hey, nice Hi, to see you guys. Hey, hello. Oh my God, I only have one girl today. What's going on with the rest? Yes. Oh yeah, Roxy's coming. Phew. <laughs> yeah, no, you know what, Nancy? I thought you will bless between these guys. Yeah. These handsome ones. And I was like, oh <laughs> my God. All righty. Hey, how's your day going? So far, the good? Yeah? Was it a good uh, weekend or no? Was it a good weekend? So, when fin de semana, was it a good weekend? No, teacher. <laughs> no? You no. got to work, Nancy? No, mi mamá salió positiva no. COVID. Me está tocando cuidarla. Oh, my God. I know how it is. I'm sorry for that. But she already has her three shots? Yes. Oh, so that's good. That's yes. positive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? That thing happened to me, but not with my mom, because my mom passed away this year. Um, my, my sister, she's pregnant. And she and she got a positive COVID. So I was like, oh my God. And she has diabetes. So I was like, no way. My sister, my hermana, está esperando bebé. Tiene diabetes y salió positiva COVID también. So can you imagine how it was like, no, but now she's okay. She's okay. She's like just living, just the last days. Oof. But for me, it was like. Tiene 66. Oh, but she's still John. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, everything will be all right. You will see. But I, pero sé que es muy difícil cuidarlos. It's not easy. Yes. I know. Mm. If anything Cansada. you want to help, I'm here, okay? Okay, thanks. Mm. Oh, it's good. You, we have Nancy. We have Karen. Finally, it's good. She's joined to this class. Hey, Karen. Hey, Kimmy. We got Rossi, Hilmita, Maria del Carmen. Good night. We have Mr. Naftali. We do have Oscar. Oscar Alberto. Jorjito. Hi, how are you? All righty. We have Marvin here. Marvin, hey. you move. <laughs> we do have Nelson. We have Will. Who else? We have Sunny. There you go. All right, Julito is joined to this class. That's Hi. good. Good evening. Good evening, Sonny. Woohoo! Hey, hey. No, no, I am not. Karen is not the one who has a, the the baby dog girl. Hey, who's who's coming right now? Okay, Jesse. Jesse's here. Very good. Hey, besides Nancy, that doesn't have a really good weekend. What about the rest? Uh huh. Anything special that you're in your weekend besides working, Neftali? Special? No. No? Did you go to your uh, sister house to have a barbecue as well? No? No, no. Gosh. Now we'll be speaking. No. no. Oh, come on. Okay. No. Only rainy here. It's, it's only rainy. Has it been rainy? Rainy, rainy, rainy. rainy. Yes. A lot? Yeah. Rainy. I think, guys, we have around almost a month right that has been yes. raining that the whole days every single yes. day during the week <laughs> yeah you know what my husband and i wanted to go to a taco uh, yesterday but it came like a rainy like a cats and dogs and we couldn't get out because we thought we're gonna go there we need to pass to los um what's the name of that highway chorros and that is a really dangerous uh, highway, right? So no. And then if we arrive to a taco, we will have to stay at the hotel because we won't be able to go out. It's going to be raining a lot. So there's no point to move. So we, and you know what? When we, when we said, hey, let's go to a taco, whiskey and chestnut are like, what? Are we leaving? Because they are literalmente pata de chuchu. These two baby dogs, loves to go out that you cannot imagine but when we say no we're going to stay home they were like mm. the four of us the four of us slept on the bed the whole afternoon can you imagine that was really good for me it was a relaxing day what about you nelson did you do something special um nothing special nothing special nothing special just stay home and watch netflix 
Yes. Uh -uh. Well, but at least something special. You watch TV. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yes. I watch TV. That's good. Sometimes we do not have even time for watch TV, right? Yeah. So that's good. What about you, Mervin? How was the university? Uh, you, you did a lot of really a lot of tests. Did you pass them all? Los pasaste todos? Did you pass them all? You don't know. 50-50. 50-50. All righty. Well, hopefully you did, okay? You will give us the news next week, maybe. You will have the, the answers, yeah. You were going to give us the news, okay? Very good. Don't worry. Be positive. You will pass it. No, Thank you're you a smart people. boy. Very good. Uh, who else? Julito, did you do something special? Um. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't. I didn't. Um, I didn't do anything. Anything? Yeah. Yes. Anything um, special? Um, special. Nah. Um, and also, nah. and also, I rest. I rest in my um house. Okay. Okay. That's good. That's it. That's it. Nothing else. Mo, but you you need to rest. You need to charge your batteries, right, guys? That's good. Good. Thank yes. you so much, Julito. What about you, uh, 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 Sonny? Sonia, did you do, did you do something special this weekend? Nothing, teacher. Nah, you know, look at her. Look at her tone of voice. Nothing, teacher. I was bored the whole afternoon. <laughs> it was raining. Oh, uh, I know, but Alicia's positive. She said nothing, teacher. All right, nothing. Is, you didn't cook anything special for your family. Uh, yeah, uh, the the partiendo. <laughs> the partiendo. What does it mean? Like este, sharing. Este, sí, una una carne en casa. Oh, so like you you cook a grill and you're sharing with your family. Yeah. Oh, you spent. Oh, you see, you did something special. <laughs> you did something. Okay. Cool. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, I, my family is not here in El Salvador, so that's special. What well, at least. Half is here and half is not. So, oh my God. So you cannot imagine, right? It's really complicated. All righty. What about Pablito Josue Cornejo? I have a long time without hearing your sexy voice. So let's listen to you. Did you do something special this weekend, Pablito? Something special this uh -huh. weekend. Maybe I like was. I, I was going to. You went. You went. 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 Uh, you went where? Uh, to the park, Bicentenario. Really, to Bicentenario Park? Hey, that's great. Yes. Alone or with your family, friends, with your dog? <laughs> no, with my girlfriend. Oh, with well, your girlfriend. Ooh, that's good. Yeah. It was like a date. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And at the same time, do an exercise together. Oh, that's amazing. That's cool. Yes. Running, running. <laughs> it, running? Oh, you do a lot of uh -huh. exercise yeah. together. Excellent. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. And after that, did you invite her to a chori? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, no. No, right? Because no, you were burning nachos. calories and eat a chori, like, no way, right? <laughs> And after that, a romantic dinner, maybe? Una cena yeah, romantica, yes. yeah? Oh. Yes, after. You, you bet, Pablito. Más te vale. You bet. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. That was amazing. That's great. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for sharing. Who else? Hilmita, what about you? Anything special? Hi, teacher. Hi. Hi. My. My day was like oh, all no nothing thing. special. You nothing is special. Daily routine. Oh no. my goodness! No, you didn't have a day <laughs> off. No. Wow. All day. All day working and working and working. Yes. Oof! No, you need to take a day off or vacation. You deserve it. You're a hard working woman. Or no. 
Yes. Yes, of course. I work. Yes, me too. Yeah, you cannot imagine. Well, you know what? It, this year was the first time in around almost six years without having a vacation. Can you imagine? So it was really nice for me. I deserve it. So, yes, you will have your vacation. You'll see. Thank you so much for sharing, Hilda. Even though you didn't do something special, but that's okay. Let's see. Let's see. Edith, what about you? Hi, teacher. Hi. Nothing? I give. Mm -hmm. I give general cleaning. You did what? Sorry, I couldn't hear you. Ah, oh, you didn't do anything, you said. She didn't do anything, she said, right? No hiciste nada, Adit? No? No. Mm, okay. <laughs> That's okay. Don't worry. That's okay. What about you? Who else? Kimi. What about you, Kimi? Anything special? No. Hello. Um... Sí, fui a mi papá y le un regalo ahí, comimos mi algo pequeño, pero en Ajá, in Spanish, but let's try to say the same idea in English, okay? Let's try. Let's do our best. Mm, uh, yes. Mm, no, uh, A little special thing. I go, thing. my father. No, you go or your father arrive to your house? ¿Ya fuiste o tu papá llegó a tu casa? Yes. Um, ¿Tu papá vino a tu casa? No, mi esposa está en el extranjero. No, no, no. Me refiero a que tu papá sí, llegó a tu casa. Ah, tú fuiste a la casa de tu papá. Ok. No, yo fui a Por eso, tú fuiste a la casa de tu papá. Ajá. Yes. Entonces puede decir, I went to my father's house. Dilo. I went to my father's house. House. And brought him a gift. Y le llevé un regalo. And brought him a gift. In brought the gift. Brought, no, brought him a gift. Brought him a gift. A gift. Very good. It, it was small but special. Dilo. It's not special. No, it was a small thing but a special. It was, was a special. No, it was a small thing. Oh, the, I dile, was, you know, it, it was, it, it was a small thing, a small thing, but a special, but a special, but a special. very good, good job, very good, ya ves que puedes, I know you can do it, very good. Mira que te de que chivo, ya hiciste una oración más larga en inglés. How do you feel? Ah, dijiste, fui a la casa de mi papá, le llevé algún regalo, era pequeño pero especial. Va. Genial. Very good job, girl. Give me Joe five. Woo. All right. What about you, Mr. Sexy Radio Boys, Mr. Santiago? Hi, Hilmita. He's your baby boy. We, we cannot listen to you, Santiago. Something's wrong with your microphone. And now? Yes, much better. Thank you, sir. Okay. I went to father-in-law. Your father-in-law house? Yes. Oh, cool. And we were, and we were mm -hmm. celebrating Father Day. You were celebrating Father's celebrating, Day. Celebrating, celebrating. Uh-huh, very good. Father Day. Father's Day. Father's Day. Very good. Uh-huh. Did That's you it. cook? Um, yes, my, my mother-in-law cooked. Ah, what did she cook? She cooked. Uh, she cooked. She cooks. No, she meat. cooked. She cooks. 
Cooked. Mm. Porque cooked. es pasado. Cooked. Ah, ok. She cooks meat. Meat. Oh. Yes. All right. We pick up the gallo, rice, and everything, right? Okay. Yes. That's good. Excellent. Mm. Yeah, maybe one, but okay, I'm hungry. All righty, guys, talking about, thank you so much, Radio Boy, Mr. Santiago. I really have to thank you guys who did your homework. Very good job. I'm so proud of you. Soy muy orgullosa de ustedes. I'm so proud of you. You broke my heart. Very good effort. Good effort. I know it was not easy because you were busy. Uh, you had to do a lot of homework. There's another activities, but very good job. There's still things that we need to improve, but that's okay. I like it. Thank you so much for being so like um, com you you did a uh, commitment or committed with your homework. You 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 know what that means? Committed. Committed. You know what that means? No. So I guess if you got committed. Cuando alguien es como responsable con lo que hace. Committed, comprometido. Podría ser la uh, traducción más acertada. Very good. So you show your commitment, su compromiso. Very good job. I know. Ajá, hay uno me la entregaron hasta today, ¿verdad? Hace media hora antes de la clase. I know, understand that. Ajá. Pero you did your effort. Sí, teacher. Tiche, sí, yo, tengo, yo tengo un problema. ¿Qué problema no, tiene usted? No, es que con el celular, por eso es que no, no le envié nada sobre la tarea. ¿va? Porque se me cayó y se me quedó blanca la pantalla. Entonces sí que no, no tengo. Y he tratado de llamar a la, a la, sí, a la corporación. ¿va? Y no me contestan porque sí. quería dar, darles otro número. Ah, para que entendí. me puedan agregar. Sí. Ajá, vaya. A mí lo, ya, pero me lo hubieras mandado de, del celular de tu hermano, de tu amigo, de tu mamá, de tu abuelita. De, no, me lo hubieras mandado de otro de celular, hombre. El problema que está de que se, es que yo no, no encendió el teléfono. Yo no, no encendió, se me quedó blanca la pantalla. No, pues blanca, sí. Completa. Hubieras usado el otro, pues. Otro celular, pues, uh -huh. para mandarme la tarea. Te perdono. Me lo mandas después. Uh -huh. Va, ok. Entonces. No te preocupes, ¿oíste? No, pero no, that's good. Porque yo le iba a dar un número, pero que es de mi hermana, que es la tablet, la tablet de ella. No que sé ahí si me lo hubiera puede... mandado, hombre. Pues sí. No, solo que no, el problema está de que no, no, no tengo el número suyo. No sé cuál es el número. Y no, el sabes de que... grupo, el de grupo también. ¿Sabes qué puedes hacer? Eh, acordarte el correo que te mandaron de inglés corporativo antes de empezar el módulo. ¿Te acordás? Donde está el link del mm. Zoom y toda la cosa, sí. ¿Te acordás? Mm -hmm. No, no, no me acuerdo. Pero, Pero ahí, ajá, ahí, y busca ese, ese correo porque ahí sale incluso el link de WhatsApp. Solo entonces lo busco. Solo, busco sí, ahí porque... solo búscalo y te va a pedir, te dice, you want to join this group? ¿Quieres unirte a este grupo? Le dices, yes, y ¡pum! ya estás. Ah, okay. Ahí me vas a encontrar a mí y me mandas la tarea, ¿te parece? Va, ok. Es el okay. único que voy a hacer la excepción. Entonces, tratar de hacerlo hoy. Y hoy se lo envíe. Por favor. Pero mira, no se te va a ocurrir. Yo soy 24-7, ah, sí. pero no lo tomes de manera tan literal, ¿oíste? O mañana, no se lo pueden mandar mañana. Eh, no. No, como no, hombre, si hoy en a, a terminar muy noche, como que no, vea. Pero por favor, en el transcurso de la mañana, te lo espero, ¿oíste? Bueno, ok. Sí, porque un, okay. Ahí tuve un alumno que lo tomó literalmente 24-7 y una vez me estaba escribiendo a las 11.59 pm. Y I was like, what? No, hombre, dije. Y al siguiente día le digo, qué bárbaro, bicho, yo creo que te lo tomaste muy literal. Y, y como trabajaba en State Dinner y él tenía el turno de la noche, eso no me estaba escribiendo, pero ya eso fue demasiado. Así que por eso les digo que no se lo vayan a tomar tan literal. Guys, let me ask you something. Uh, vamos a ver. Uh -huh. yes. I want to know. Yes. Dígame, Fernan Fer Fer Fernando. Ahí es Fernando. Yes. Te, lo, te lo puedo mandar ahorita, 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 lo de la tarea. Porque no lo mandé porque había dicho que hasta las tres no daba y que si no, no lo mande. Sí, es cierto, bueno, porque yo, los, los tengo haciendo, que hacer responsables. Estaba haciendo un parcial cuando... Tenía que enviarlo, ya no, ya era muy tarde. ¿Y por qué no me escribiste antes? 
Eso, cuando ¿verdad? tengas un issue sí, así, ajá, cuando usted haga un issue así, que sea de peso, ¿verdad? Me dice, fíjate, chica, te voy a decir esto, 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 Porque acuérdense que communication es, 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 es the clue, es la clave. ¿sí? O, por ejemplo, les pasa algo eh, como Neftalí que, que le pasó algo a su perrito o algo por el estilo. Right? O sea, cosas así que son, ya sé, fuera de tu control. I, I agree. Pero otras cosas que son en tu control, I'm not agree. ¿Oíste? Así que me lo hubiera dicho, hombre. Ahí me la mandas también. Sí, sí. Va. Pero para futures, me lo pones, ¿oíste? Muy bien. Guys, I want to know which days you wake up early. ¿Qué días se levantan temprano? Which days do you wake up early? Or do you wake up early? Monday. Monday. ¿Qué más? Weekday. Monday. Monday. Tuesday. Weekday. Weekday. Weekdays. Hey. Neftali, I think you every single day, right? Except Mondays. <laughs> yes, from well, Monday. All okay, day. all days. All right. Which days do you wake up late? Sunday. Sunday? Sunday? Only Sunday? Saturday. Saturday, Saturday too. Too. Okay, Sunday and Saturday. Okay. And everybody is the same or you have different schedule? I think Neftali, no. Neftali, do you wake up late on Monday? Yes. On yes, Monday. right. Why? Why? Yeah. ¿Por qué? Why? ¿Cómo podría decirle? I have only, only Monday, but I, I work. Uh, from from uh -huh. from uh, you know, Tuesday uh -huh. uh, to Sunday. Very good. It's so when I work from Tuesday to Sunday. Ah, quiere decir que Monday es tu único día libre. How do you say día libre in English? How do you say that? Day off. Very good. Off. Thank you, Walter. Day off. Ahí te lo voy a escribir ahorita. Day off. Y esa sí va con doble F. Day off. Entonces, cuando tú dices que tengo mi día libre, tú dices, I do have my day off. O si no lo quieres decir tan largo, puedes decir, my day off is on Monday. Teacher, ¿se puede decir day free? No. No. Okay. No. Eso lo traducirías, traducirías como muy literal y por lo menos si tú quieres decir que un día libre, porque free es libre, pero libre, Neftali, de que tú eres libre de, de, ¿cómo te puedo decir? Físico. Por ejemplo, I'm free to fly. ¿Sí? I'm, o I'm free cuando no tiene, <ríe> es como decir I'm single. Ajá. O tú okay. puedes decir I'm free. On Sunday, por ejemplo, alguien te dice, ¿tenés planes eh, para el sábado? No, I'm free, decís tú, ¿verdad? Estoy libre, ¿sí? Pero si tú quieres decir que you have a day that you rest, that you don't go to work, day off, ¿ok? Dime, Walter. Para un ángulo hablante, eh, free day sonaría como a día gratis. Sí. Ajá. Pero día gratis, ¿de qué? O sea, del trabajo, o sea, trabajo es free day. day. No, trabajo es a day off. No, o sea, trabajo sin paga. Free day. Eh, no, cuando tú dices free day, es que tú estás libre para ir a algún lugar. Uh -huh. ¿Me entiendes? Pero si tú estás diciendo día libre de no trabajar. Day off. Day off. ¿Eh? Por eso es que les digo yo, porque a veces uno tiende como a, a traducir literalmente. Nosotros tenemos otras maneras de decir las cosas. Entonces, es muy importante que ustedes sepan cuál es la manera correcta. Entonces, entonces si tú quieres decir, mi día lunes, mi día libre es el lunes, ¿cómo lo dirías, Neftali? My day off is Monday. Is, ajá, is Monday. O, o tú puedes decir, yeah. todos los lunes tengo, di, tengo libre. Ah, every, every Sunday. Every, no, every lunes. Monday. Yes, sí, perdón. Every Monday. Eh, is It's my uh, day off. Oh, it's my day off. Mm -hmm. 
on my day off is on Monday. También. ¿Te acuerdas la preposition of time? Sí. Very good. Excellent. Hoy les hago otra pregunta, chicos. A ver qué me contestan. What's something you do before eight in the morning? ¿Qué es algo que usted hace antes de las ocho de la mañana? What is something you do before eight in the morning? Puede ser during the week or during weekends. Pero veamos during the week. ¿Qué es lo que usted hace antes de las ocho de la mañana? Ajá, I Zule. Brush the teeth. You brush your teeth. Very good, Kimi. What else? I drink coffee. You drink coffee? Oh, yeah. Without we'll gasoline, you're going to work. Y el pan? Why the pan? Pan with sweet bread. Depende. Con pan, pan o con pan dulce? Bread. With sweet bread. Con pan dulce. Uh huh. What else? I check what? my car. You check your car. Okay. What else? Yes. ¿Qué más? I take my breakfast. You take your breakfast. You take your breakfast or you have your breakfast. Es mejor decir I have my breakfast. Okay. I get my get breakfast. Sí, ya sí, I have my breakfast. Eh, pero también podemos decir I get. I get I get my breakfast. Mm, sí se me. puede, sí se puede, pero si usted por ejemplo dice yo eh, obtengo mi desayuno de tal lugar. Ok. Como que lo va a comprar. Exactamente. Así. Por eso es importante lo, 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 el, los verbos correctos. Sí. Si, prepare is, is make. Prepare. Prepare. Prepare my lunch, prepare my dinner. Uh -huh. O si yeah. usted quiere decir preparo desayuno para mi familia, I prepare breakfast I for, prepare... for my family. For, for my, my kids. Mm -hmm. I prepare breakfast for my family. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Very good. Ajá. ¿Qué, ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más hace? Gilmita, ¿qué más haces tú before 8 a.m.? I prepare uh, the breakfast for my children. Mm -hmm. And I go into the drug uh, school for my children. Oh, so you go to the school. Okay. You drive them to school. Yeah. You, dr you drive them or take them to school. Drive. Los llevas. Los llevas. Si tú quieres decir, los llevo, I take them to school. Pero yeah. si tú quieres decir que tú los llevas en el carro, I drive them to school. Okay. Sí, porque si decimos take, puede ser que tomaste Uber, que tomaste el carro, que te fuiste a la bicicleta, que te fuiste en el bus. No lo especificas. ¿Sí? Okay. Very good. Excellent. Good job, Hilmita. And what about you, Jorgito? Okay. What do you do before 8 a.m.? First, I check my cell phone for a new message. Imagínese, tan clavado está con el teléfono que yo creo que lo duerme a la par. Because, no, because I, my boss uh, always Say you check your phone the first hour because really uh, he uh, sometimes he, sometime he sends a message very Som important. Sometimes he sends an important message. Yeah, an important message so, before 8 a.m. Yeah. Wow. La ves? Mm -hmm. Yo creo que aquí así Jorgito a dormirme. <risa> Igual que Mr. Bean, en vez de, en vez de comprarle un sofá al Teddy, ah, le, ah, le compra sí, un sofá al, al celular y hasta, le, hasta lo abriga. <risa> y de, pero yo no sé cómo hace para dormir. Las, creo que no, para dormir le hace así. Ve. Y le apaga la pantalla. <risa> All righty. Very good. Job. He's turned off the, the camera, right? All right. Or the, or the, or the plate. Or the screen. Very good. Vamos a ver. Mm, what about Sunday and Saturday before 8 a.m.? Do you do something special? Antes de las 8 de la mañana, ¿alguien hace algo? Ajá. ¿No? Thank you. Uh, voy a la iglesia, pero no sé cómo se dice. I go to the church. Or I go to church. Yes. You go to church. Okay, yes. very good. Very good, Jesse. All righty, Oscar I Alberto. Take a cold shower. You get a cold shower to wake up. Yes. Oscar Alberto, what about you? I cannot listen to your beautiful voice. Wilson, welcome, Wilson. 
Ajá, Jorgito. Oscar Alberto, perdón. Sorry. Good night, teacher. Hola. Good night. Se escucha. Sí, yes. We can listen to you very well. Eh, casi no escucho ahorita. Está lloviendo. What fuerte. about now? Can you listen to me? ¿Me escuchas? Eh, yeah. Yes, un poquito. Un poquito. ¿Qué haces tú antes de las 8 de la mañana, un sábado o un domingo? What do you do before 8 a.m. in the morning? Uh, I feed my pets. You feed your pets, okay. That's it. Le da de comer a los chicos y después vuelve a la cama. <laughs> and Kim is like, yes, that's for sure. <laughs> All right, let me ask you another question, guys. What's something that you do on Saturday evenings? Saturday evenings. What something that you do on Saturday evenings? Uh, Nelson? Um, Saturday on, evenings. On, on Saturday, um, I drink coffee it, uh, with, it, with bread. With sweet with bread. bread. In the evening. Yes. In la noche. Um, bueno, no hay hora, vea. <laughs> All righty, very good. That's a good one. Yo pensé que me iba a decir popcorn. Nah, todo lo... Dime, dime, dime. I eat uh, pupusas. Pupusas. Yes, ah, yeah. Yes, yes. I go to. Uh -huh. Pupusas. Also pupusas. <laughs> What about evening? Very... Evening of 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 pupusas. Oh, really? All evening or all Saturday evenings? Yes. All, ah. uh, all Saturday, all weekend, all weekend. Oh, that's yes. that's a rule, right? It's not yes. a regular. That's a rule. Like my mama. That's a rule. My, my mama used to buy tamales every Saturday. From Friday. Uh huh. From day off. From Friday. Ah. Yes, from ah, Friday, okay. Friday, Sunday, uh, Sunday, Monday. But, ah, but, for the three days. Sunday. Wow. Yes. Woohoo! That's good. What about you, Sule? Watch the movie, teacher. You watch a movie, Kimi. Okay, cool. What about you, Zule? Um, <laughs> I have uh, one beer. <laughs> ah, every single Saturday <laughs> evening. Oof. A lot of beer. <laughs> one. No, she said one. <laughs> Don't tell me first of the message, huh? <laughs> Uh -huh. Only one. Uh -huh. Una no es ninguna. Entonces you start all over again. I'm just kidding. One box. Ajá, sí, ella dijo solo She's una. Relax. No, one even box. cuando. All right, very good. <laughs> eh, Marina, del, Marina del Carmen, what about you, my baby girl? What you do you do on Saturday evening? Um, nothing special. Only work. Only work. Um, you work on Saturdays. Okay. What about you, Edith? With my oh, you watch TV with your kids. That's good. Roxy, what about you? Hi, I Hi. watch I watch uh, movies and series with my son. In series with your son, Netflix series. Mm, yeah. uh, a veces. Sometimes, sometimes. Uh -huh. Sometimes. Very good. Thank you. Karen Michelle, what about you, girl? I watch my favorite novel. So Popras. It's Betty La Fea. So Popras, Betty La Fea. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Hilmita? Are you agree with Karen Michelle? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Uh, it is said that uh, Michelle is the same. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> ah, you see? You said hey, I see, you, you I telephone see each other, other right? On the two. <laughs> ah, you telephone each other and say, hey, Betty La Fe is about to start. Right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. That's cool. Thank you. And Wilson, what about you? What you do on Saturday evening? What do you do? Wilson. I think Wilson stood up, went to the refrigerator, 
and have a glass of Coca-Cola. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. Hi, what do you do on Saturday evening? ¿Qué haces en el, los sábados en la noche? Pero ya bien tarde. ¿eh? Um, ya bien tarde. Sí, pero no a las 12, um, tipo 6 en adelante. From um, 6 p.m. and on. Um, watch a movie. Watch a movie. Or, uh, <laughs> I don't believe you, but continue. <laughs> um, listen, listen to music. Ah, listen to music. Ahí sí te creo. Uh -huh. Very good. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you so okay. much. And last but not least, guys, what do you do only, only on Sundays? Besides Jessie that said that she, she goes to the church. What else? Only activity that you only do on Sundays. La actividad que solamente se lee los domingos. Think about it. Piénsalo. Think about it. And let us know. Ir al culto, a la iglesia. You, you go to the church. Okay, very good. I buy, I buy uh, food uh, from church. You buy the food they cook. From, uh, from the church. Ah, okay, okay. Yes. Very good. They cook. They, they cook, cook there. Okay. They cook there, you know. Ah, or, okay. Uh, they, they, they cook. They, they are, they uh, are uh -huh. construction and uh -huh. a new church. Ah, okay. They cook there and they and it is for benefit. It's benefit. It's, it's benefit. benefit. Yeah. Ah, okay. It's benefit, yes. It's to save or to earn money for a new church construction. Yes. Ah, okay. Got Pane it. Con pollo. Pane con Pane pollo. Con pollo. All right. You're really good. And, yes. and you know, Karen Zulema is like, woohoo, very good. <laughs> All right. Very good. What else? What else do you do on Sunday? Only on Sunday. Don't tell me Suleyma that another verb because I don't believe you. <laughs> don't cook, teacher. You don't All cook. No. Okay, kitchen is closed. Yes. <laughs> cool. Because I cook all weekend. Yes, of course. You know what? You should buy like a little um, I don't know, advertising that said kitchen closed every Sunday. Weekend off chicken. Weekend off. <laughs> Chicken, chicken and kitchen, chicken. both. And a kitchen. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, no, kitchen. that's okay. Very good. What about you, Nelson? Uh, on Sunday. Yes, only on Sunday. An uh, activity on, that on, you do only that day. Uh, on Sunday, re review the English class uh, of English Corporativo. He's a big duncan, right? No. <laughs> Very good. I congratulations. I feel okay. proud of yourself. And I listen to music in English. Ah, you uh, see. Too. Oh, that's really good. Good point. Excellent. I'm going, I'm going to share right now a, a type of um, music today, a lyrics for one music, so you can practice your English, okay? I will send it today. So you can okay. practice your English. Very good. Thank you. Thank you so much for that idea. That's good. What about you, Mervyn? Visit different, visit different places in the country uh -huh. with my family. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's good. Pablito Reyes, what about you? Something that you do only on Sundays? Um, I dream. <laughs> you drink? You drink what? <laughs> no, uh, I... Uh, uh, out house, Lisa, salir de casa. You go out from home. You go out. You go out. You, you go out, uh, pasear. I no, yeah. Go out. Mm -hmm. I go out. You said I go out. I go out, uh, family. Um, ah, you spend time uh, with your family. Flores, A flower flores. root. Flower root. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. good. That is one of my um, yeah amazing places. My favorite places to visit. Okay. Um, watch, watch uh, soccer. Watch soccer. Um, watch soccer mm -hmm. on the TV. Or on the TV. On the TV. Okay. I thought you play mm -hmm. soccer. No. I, I guess uh, I I can I can play soccer. Are you can play soccer? Ooh, ooh that's good. Papi football. No. 
I'm just yes. asking. Yes, yes. <laughs> so tell me, it's like, yeah. I don't know. I was asking, and he said, yes, you see, so le atiné. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Pablito. Now I want to listen to the other Pablito, Pablito Josué Cornejo. What do you do okay. only on Thank Sunday? You. Um, the Sunday, I on Sunday, I go to the church. You go to church, very good, yeah. very good. What about you, Walter? What do you do only on Sunday? On Sunday, um, mm -hmm. we rest, my wife and I. Ah, okay. And we do some work around the the house. A house chores. Uh, but after dinner, my wife and I have the habit of watch. And they show Little House on the prior on YouTube. Ah, really? O occasionally we go out, uh -huh. but I, I, I really like the show. You really like the show? In Spanish, La Familia Ingalls. Ah, oh, yeah, I like it. Yeah, I like it too. That is a really like old show, right? But it's really beautiful. I like it. I love Familia Ingalls. They already passed away, <laughs> but I love it. It's really nice. It's a really nice program. What else? Uh, Sonny, I know. what about you, Sonny? Uh, in the morning, uh, I go to church. You go to the church? In, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. In the evening, uh, I go to walk and eat pupusas. <laughs> and eat pupusas. Yeah. Uh, OK. <laughs> Uh, lo hace al revés. Primero walk and then eat pupusa. No debería ser al revés, vea. Eat pupusa and then walk. Así lose no. calories, right? Uh -huh. Pues sí. Okay, very good, very good. Okay. Thank you. What about you, Julito? I watch my favorite um, series really? on my cell phone. On uh -huh. my cell phone. Um, I watch a new... Um, Noticias, news. News? news Very news. good. Um, yes. Good job. And last but not least, I want to hear Jorgito Alberto. What do you do only on weekends? In my case, I have three, three, uh, all Sunday. Uh -huh. First, in the morning, I'm going to the church. You go to church, okay. Uh, in the uh, afternoon, afternoon I yeah. I play I watch uh, a match on the soccer TV. match soccer match on uh -huh. the on TV. and for the dinner I eat pupusa with my family. Oh, so that's a rule. Every Sunday yeah. is that cell yeah, routine. Every Sunday. Okay, cool. It's oh, a routine. <laughs> hey, that's cool. Very good. Thank you so much for sharing, guys. Everybody broke my heart. You see? Hey, all right. Very good. Good job. Hey, did you like Mr. Bean? Le gustó el que le mandé de Mr. Bean? Yeah. Very fun. Yes, I like it. Ay, yeah. me mato la chiste con ese hombre. Es que, es que a mí lo que me gusta es que nunca se quiere levantar y cuando pone el dedito, cuando le cae la agüita. <risa> Ay, me mata del chiste. Es que buenísimo. De verdad que sí, ya ven, daily routine y tengo más. No se preocupen. Ay, poco a poco les voy a ir mandando la información. Very good. Eh, now, guys, eh, si ustedes se fijan, hoy hemos empezado mucho talking, talking, talking. Necesito irlos a hablar. Hoy vamos a ir un poco. Thank you, Sonny. Hoy vamos a ir un poco de listening. Fíjense que aquí tengo exactamente tres conversaciones. Uh, y necesito, vamos a oír, por ejemplo, a uh, tres individuos, Greg, Megan, y Lori, que talk about daily routines. ¿sí? Y prácticamente quiero que ustedes me digan, en el caso de Greg, eh, quiero que me digan a qué hora se levanta a qué hora se va a la casa y a qué hora se va a dormir. Sí, eh, vamos a ver. De hecho, ustedes tienen que eh, poner atención a las tres eh, conversaciones porque quiero que capten cuatro cosas. El trabajo que ellos hacen, the job, a what time he gets up, a qué hora se levanta, a what time he gets home at, ¿sí? a qué hora se regresa a su casa. 
y a qué, a qué, a qué horas, a what time he goes to bed. Eso es lo que yo quiero que, que piensen ahorita. Son cuatro cosas. ¿Qué cosas quiero que se enfoquen? El trabajo. ¿A qué hora se levanta? ¿A qué hora se vuelve de regreso? ¿Y a qué horas se va para la cama? ¿Sí? Son tres. Yo voy a ser bien mala. Bien mala. Porque esta vez no les voy a dar writing. Solo van a hacer, sí, Santiago. Porque se acuerdan que yo bien buena onda, primero les pongo el listening, después les doy el writing y después les, les voy poniendo uno por uno. ¿eh? Hoy me voy a hacer bien mala. Como ahorita solo estamos, exactly, I got my eyes on you, I got my eyes on you. Entonces, eh, voy a ponerlo dos veces, I will play two times. La primera va a ser de corrido. ¿Sí? Y la segunda, si voy a pausar entre cada uno. Okay, I will make a pause between each conversation. ¿Les parece? Y dice, no, pues ni modo, pues, ¿eh? vamos. ¿eh? Mm -hmm. Hey, Marvin, yes. Yes. Hasta levanta la cejita el Marvin. <laughs> Very good. ¿Oíste? Entonces, así vamos a hacer. Are you guys ready? Ready. Mm -hmm. yes, yes, we're ready. Are you guys ready? Yes, I'm ready. ready. Yes, yes, yes. We're ready. We're ready. Are you guys ready? Yes, we're yes, ready. Man. That's oh, my energy. Man. Come on, it's Monday morning. We're ready to rock and roll, right? All right, let's move on, guys. Puchicas, <laughs> teacher, me dejar ya sordo, man. Very good. Démosle, pues. Ta-da! Exercise 10. Listening. Daily schedules. Mm -hmm. Part A. Listen to Greg, Megan, and Lori talk about their daily schedules. Complete the chart. What do you do, Greg? I'm a mechanic. Oh, yeah? So, what are your work hours like? They're okay. I work in the mornings and afternoons. I get up around 6 a.m., and I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I go to bed at 10. And what do you do, Megan? Well, I'm a receptionist. It's a regular 9 to 5 office job, so I get up at 7 a.m. and get home around 6 p.m. That's okay, though, because I like to go out at night. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. What about you, Lori? Well, my hours are a bit different. I'm a nurse. I start work at 11 o'clock at night. I work until 7 a.m. Wow! So, what time do you get up? I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30, and I sleep until 4 p.m. And what do you do in the evenings? Oh, you know, I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. It's a great schedule for me. Aha! All right. Let's do it step by step, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, let me ask you something. What is the, uh, Greg's job? He's a mechanic. He's a mechanic. A mechanic. Very good, very good. What about Megan? Megan, she's a receptionist. A receptionist. 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 What about uh, Laurie? Nurse. She's a nurse. 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 All right. Very good. Démoslo otra vez. Let's do it again. Page 12, exercise 10, listening. Daily schedules. Part A. Listen to Greg, Megan, and Lori talk about their daily schedules. Complete the chart. What do you do, Greg? I'm a mechanic. Oh, yeah? So, what are your work hours like? They're okay. I work in the mornings and afternoons. I get up around 6 a.m., and I work from 7 a.m. until 3 p.m. I get home pretty early, about 4 p.m. I go to bed at 10. Okay, at what time he gets up? Uh, repeat, 6 a.m. At what time he gets up? No. No. Oh. He says, at 6 a.m. or seven. around? Around 6 a.m. Around 6 a.m. Wow. He didn't specify at 6. He said around. So it could be 
555, etc. Okay, at what time he comes back mm -hmm. home? At 4 p.m. At 4 p.m. Very good. Because he's finished a shift at 3. And at what time he go to bed? 10. He goes 10. To bed at 10. 10. Very good. That's good. Let's listen to Megan. And what do you do, Megan? Well, I'm a receptionist. It's a regular 9 to 5 office job. So I get up at 7 a.m. and get home around 6 p.m. That's okay, though, because I like to go out at night. I go to bed around midnight on weekdays. All right, what about her? What time she gets up? 7 a.m. 7 a.m. 7 a.m. What about at what time she comes back home? 6 p.m. And at what time she goes back to bed? Midnight. 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 Around midnight. And the last one. <laughs> and Lori, let's double check. What Lori. about you, Lori? Well, my hours are a bit different. I'm a nurse. Mm -hmm. I start work at 11 o'clock at night. I work until 7 a.m. Wow. So what time do you get up? I get home at 8 and go to bed at about 8.30. Mm -hmm. And I sleep until 4 p.m. And what do you do in the evenings? Oh, you know. I have dinner, watch TV, see friends. It's a great schedule for me. Okay, what about Loria? What time she gets up? It's up. It's 7 a.m. <laughs> what about at what time she uh, go back home? A. 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 And at what time she go back to bed? 8.30. 30. All righty, very good. Now let me ask a quick question, guys. I want to know your opinion. Who do you think has the best daily schedule? Who has the best daily schedule? Greg. Greg, Megan, or Lori? ¿Qué piensan? ¿Qué tiene el mejor schedule? For me, Greg. For you, Greg. Greg? Greg. Everybody Greg. ready? Greg? All Greg. right. Greg. Tell me why. Yes. Why do you Perfect. think he has a be the best schedule? Why? Por qué? Because he works he start he work all day. At because he finish for around he, 4 He's early in his home. Aha, uh -huh. he's early back home. Some evening. Mm -hmm. I heard you say something, Hilmita. Can you repeat it? Uh, yes, because he returned the house very early. Very good. So you agree with your your, your partner, right? See, sí. eh, at four. Very good. Very good. Aha. Uh -huh. yeah, yes. I think I have similar schedule. That's nice. <laughs> yeah. Well, not really. Pero sería genial, verdad? Very good, very good. Uh -huh. Dime, Neftali. Ajá. Uh -huh. Fíjense que hoy ha llegado una hora súper especial. ¿Sabían eso? Sí. You know why? ¿Saben por qué? No tienen ni idea. No. Ah. Tal vez vamos a escuchar algún audio. Ah, it's a big possibility. Sí, it's a big possibility. Vamos a ver si podemos escuchar algo ahorita. <laughs> sí. Eh, vamos a ver esto. Ok, vamos a ponerle ok. Ajá. Vaya, lo voy a compartir y vamos a ver de quién estamos hablando, ¿verdad? That would be really nice. No voy a escoger a todos por falta de tiempo, ¿verdad? Y no hubiera sido una hora completa. <risa> Pero vamos a escuchar a lo mucho unos cinco, ¿verdad? Lo mucho, lo mucho, no se preocupen. ¿Ready? A ver si va a ser el lucky one usted. El suertudo, suertuda. Ready, ready. <risa> vamos a ver. Day routine. Ajá. I get at at five three in the morning breakfast at 7 a.m 
I go to work at 7.45. He went to work at night. Lunch between 12 and 1 in the afternoon. My work ends 6 p.m. I get home 8 p.m. I have dinner at 8.30. I sleep at 11 at night. Ajá. Ya fue el primero. ¿Quién es? I think she said it. No sé. No, yo no sé. Espérense. Pero miren qué diferente es. Cuando usted lo dice y qué chido se siente cuando escucharse uno mismo. ¿eh? Ajá. Ajá. Aquí no vamos a decir nombres, no se preocupen, pero yo sé quién es. Pero muy bien, ya ven, están haciendo su esfuerzo. Perfecto. Yes, vamos a ver quién más. Vamos a ver otra víctima, perdón, otro participante. Yo creo que este participante se va a identificar. Ajá, déjeme ver, a ver si de casualidad este participante se puede escuchar el solito. A ver si me deja descargarlo a este participante. Ajá. Vamos a ver, let's share. Ok. My name is Jorge. My name is, para ahora, vamos, a ver, vamos a ver. Ya lo adelanté. Sí. So, I get up at 5 a.m. from Monday to Friday. After that, I take a shower. So, I get dressed. Later, I have breakfast. After I brush my teeth, then I go to work at 6 a.m. And I start to work at 7 a.m. After I always check my email, but I don't always re reply to them in medial mediately so i have lunch at noon and re return to work at 1 pm i finish to work at 5 pm then i i take the bus at home and after I get off dressed, then I have dinner, later I watch TV with my family around two hours, and after I brush my teeth, and also I have English class at 9 p.m. until 10 p.m. from Monday to Thursday and finally I go to bed. Very good. Ya ven, ¿qué tal este? Eh? Good, ¿verdad? Ya se Fantastic. identificó. Ya, ya se identificó, you see? Very good, very good. Vamos a escuchar unos dos más y después quiero hacer un, un recap con ustedes sobre algunas a palabras que podemos pronunciar un poquito mejor, pero eso es a nivel general todo lo que he identificado. No crean si yo los escucho a cada uno de ustedes, hasta mi esposo estaba escuchando conmigo y el wiki también. <ríe> sí, en serio, crean que chivo, la pasamos súper bien, ¿eh? no crean que estábamos a, a criticando, no bien chivo, le gustó, a mi esposo le gustó y les manda felicidades. Y dice, bárbaros estos chicos, dicen, yeah, ya sí. yeah, ven, no, si sí, no crean. A ver, este va a ser uno de los últimos, porque a veces yo decía, hay unos que se les olvida decir que se lavan los dientes de cachabuer, y yo digo, ¿será que este se baña o no se baña? No, yo, yo decía, a ver, vamos a ver, ok, let's share right now my screen.
Hello, I get up at 6.30 a.m. I go to work at 7.30 a.m. Breakfast at work and I go a lot in the morning to later have lunch at 12 o'clock. I return home at 6 p.m. Then I have dinner at 7 p.m. with my family. And from 9 to 10 p.m. I have English class. I brush my teeth and go to bed at 11 p.m. And I fall asleep at midnight. ¿Qué tal, eh? Ah, bien cabal, ¿verdad? Hoy una chiquilla. Ups. Espérenme. Lo puse otra vez, vean, no, qué barbaridad, ya le gustó a Ticho. <risa> very good, very good. Bien, ya escuchamos a otra chiquilla acá. Vamos a ver, es la última. La última, la última, vamos a ver. Quiero ver a esta chica. Ay, esta chica, ¿cómo que no me lo mandó? El archivo no me lo acepta. Ni modo, vamos a escuchar a este. Este me hizo pensar. ¿Será que...? Ajá. Ajá, aquí está. Este chico, hasta música le puso de fondo. That was nice. Pero este, me, este no mencionó nada de take a shower, go, do esa brush the teeth. Yo dije, y este chavo, le pude eso en, en duda su higiene personal. But that's okay, dije yo. And <laughs> está bien. All righty, let me share this. <laughs> Breakfast. Ah, no, 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 no es ella. Ya le gustó, teacher. No, es el, espérenme, el otro. <laughs> All righty. Ajá, este es cabal. Este es... <ríe> Jessica se mata del chiste. Sí, imagínate, Jessica. Hoy sí. This is my daily routine. Every day I get up around 7 in the morning. I go to work at 8 o'clock. I work in a prison. I'm a supervisor there. I leave work at four and get home at five. I play soccer in the evening and sometimes I listen to music in my home studio. My English class at nine o'clock. My teacher is very nice. She always call me the radio void I don't know what <laughs> and I like that <laughs> I go to bed at 11 and I finish my day thanking God for everything díganme si no este chavo realmente me puede para narrador hasta ahí me dijo mi esposo este buenísimo para narrador oficial ve <laughs> That's good. Adivinaron quién es. Who's that guy? Santiago, Santiago. Se es. identificó. Oh, Santi, Santi. Sería el corno que no voice. era. The radio boys. The radio boys. Walter hasta se durmió. Ay, no, qué chistoso. Very good. All righty. Bueno, chicos, ya por último, quiero share con ustedes algunas palabras que pues vi, ¿verdad? En la mayoría de ustedes, o por decir casi en todos, que we can improve our pronunciation. Que eso es lo que a mí me interesa. Eh, esto, con esto vamos a terminar hoy. Permítame. Ahí está. Ok. Eh, ahí está. Este es. ¿Pueden verlo? ¿Sí? Ok. Por ejemplo, algo que noté mucho es la pronunciation. Eh, de AM y PM. Can you please repeat after me? AM. 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 PM. 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 P
prepare lunch, lunch. I connect to English class. Lo que le estaba diciendo a Hilma, take to school or take my son and daughter to school. English class. Take to school. Take my son. My son, my daughter. To school. O my kids, depende si lo quieres decir junto, ¿verdad? My shift ends at. Mi jornada termina a. And dinner. Dinner. Esto necesito que pronuncie más porque yo no oigo la K. Break fast. Break Break fast. Break fast. Break fast. Break Break fast. Break Break fast. Break fast. También las terminaciones. Por ejemplo, usted dice, mi día comienza. My day starts. Usted dice toma un baño. Take a shower. Take a shower. Take a shower. Y usted dice yo trabajo desde casa. I work from home. I work from home. Usted dice mi esposo o mi esposa vende. Por ejemplo, my wife husband sells. My wife Usted dice, yo contacto a cliente o, am, o llamo a los clientes. I contact or call clients. I call clients. Clients. Dice, nosotros tenemos el almuerzo a tal hora. We have lunch at. We have lunch at. Ese también, mire. Around. 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 Usted quiere decir seis y media. Usted puede decir six thirty. Six thirty. Usted lo quiere decir AM o PM está bien, pero también puede decir a uh, treinta minutos pasadas las seis. Usted puede decir thirty minutes past six. Thirty minutes past six. Past six. Very good. Como dijo mi querido amigo, radio voice. Radio voice. Y si hay alguien dice que come un desayuno, pero gigante. Yo digo, o sea, te le cabe tanto. I eat a lot for breakfast. I eat a lot for breakfast. A lot of fast. Ah, no, a lot of no, a lot for. Ok. A lot for breakfast. Uh, yeah. like, y usted dice, right. vuelvo a casa, Fast. puede decirlo de dos maneras. Return back home o I came back home at. Return back home. Back home. Back home. I came back home at. Very good. Back. Usted dice, en el último, I have. Dinner, porque alguien me dijo diner, no. It's dinner. Dinner. I have dinner. Very good. Exacto. Dinner. Eso fue lo que yo noté a nivel general, ¿sí? En las cositas que podemos seguir pronunciando más. No hay ningún problema. O, o mejorar un poquito la pronunciación. Como les digo, I really congratulate all of you. Miren, les, los aplauso. Le vamos a dar así las felicitaciones. Y tiene mi corazón. You have my heart. Very good job. Vamos a seguir mejorando. ¿Qué tal para hacer su primera vez? ¿Le gustó cómo, cómo sonaban? Chivo, ¿verdad? Es que se siente genial oírse a uno mismo. Yo los oí a todos. Y los felicito. Good, good job. Guys, yo sé que el pobre Walter ya está al borde del colapso, porque ya usted quiere dormir, porque él dice que se duerme a las 10 y media, o sea que en 22 minutos se va a la camita. Ok, ok, so hugs and kisses. See you tomorrow, ok? Bye bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye.